PV coaxial cable typically has a characteristic impedance of 75 ohms while the output impedance of an amateur radio is 50 ohms. So if you use a TV cable for amateur radio, there will be feeder losses. Ideal would be to use a cable like RZ213 with characteristic impedance of 50 ohms. As a disclaimer, I was using TV cable for my solid state VU2 VWN QRP and 3 into 807 hybrid QRO, both homebrew. But at that time, I did not have access to RG213. Moreover, as a rule, vacuum tubes were more tolerant to mismatches than the current day solid state devices. Though I never had my 807s going QRT, I had lost many BD137s which were used as final for the solid state QRP. I kept on replacing them and sometimes even cooling them with a small aluminium dish with ice kept over the BD-139 as a homebrew heat sink. When I bought a VHF base station later, I could get RZ213 cables. That VHF base station is working even today after 25 years, even though it has some snags, obviously as it was kept idle for the past 10 years.